What's up, YouTube? This is Herb Vernacular TV. If you like the content that I'm producing, please like and subscribe to my channel. Today, I want to have a discussion. I want to have a discussion and try to explain what may be going on within the international energy market that may be driving price up. Why are we paying for more? Why are we paying for why are we pay more for gas and oil at the pump? What is going to take to heat up our homes this winter time? Why are we supposed to pay more for heating up our homes this winter time? President Joe Biden, Energy Secretary Jennifer Granholm, she stated that the price of energy is rising and it's going to take much more for the average family to heat up their home this winter time. So we're going to have to cough up more money to pay for our energy bill. What is going on in the marketplace? That making the demand for energy much more high than it was, let's say, last year. One reason could be the pandemic. The pandemic has had a tremendous effect on the global economy as well as the domestic economy. As nation states around the world, as countries around the world begin to open up their border, the natural flow of goods and services the natural flow of global or, or, or global travel as it continued to take place as country begun to open up energy is going to be needed the traveling the airline industry the tourism the shipping industry and just the average customer energy is going to be needed so the demand is very high in the market right now that's the reason and prices are soaring prices are also soaring because the energy narrative, the discourse on energy internationally and domestically is taking place. Fossil fuel versus green energy. There's a climate summit that is going on right now in Scotland. The COP26 trying to do away with polluting the planet, coming up with solution to limit the pollution of the planet. But fossil fuel still rule the day. But now fossil fuel is being rivaled by a new idea, a new technology, a new idea. Do you really believe that fossil fuel is going to lay down the oil, the gas, the coal, the fracking, the tar sand? Do you believe the old idea is going to lay down for the new idea such as green energy to take place? The nuclear, the solar, the wind. These dynamics are taking place within the impending oil war. The impending oil war is a global war. You see what's going on in Europe with gas prompt, the North Screen 2 pipeline, all this geopolitical, all this geopolitical or uh, scramble over energy is very important. China. How is China gonna pledge to the Paris Accord? How is India gonna pledge to the Paris Accord when China have 1.45 billion people they got to meet their energy needs india over a billion people they got to meet their energy needs how are these nations gonna be able to meet the agreement that was met at the paris accord energy is needed right now as the global economy open back up energy will be needed energy is needed in all facets of our lives from washing our clothes to driving cars to heating our homes, military applications, technology, the sources of energy is needed. Who controls the energy source of an of its enemy? Basically, control its enemy. This is why sanction is being waged because it's the battle of energy. It's the battle of who going to control the narrative on energy. Are we going to use fossil fuel or are we going to use green energy? That discourse is taking place within the context of why prices are rising within the international and global economy. Why prices are rising. Then we look at APEC. OPEC. OPEC said it's not producing any more oil at any more rate than it's doing right now. It's going to keep the market production at its steady, at its steady, at its steady pace in which it is producing at the moment. So the need. The need for oil is driving up the demand. The need for oil is driving up prices. As we assess all these things, we can see why oil prices are going up. 
fossil fuel versus green energy. That narrative is taking place also within the United States, within the in, in, in the context of left-right politics. Former President Trump, you say he's going to bring the coal back. He's going to bring fossil fuel back. He's going to bring tar sand so we can be energy efficient. But here on the, on the left-hand side, these folks are bringing the new idea in of green energy. They're promoting green energy. So these discourses taking place. All these may give you an idea as to why prices are rising up in the, in the market. As, as nation open back up, energy is going to be needed to carry on business and commerce as usual.